Hi, and welcome to Rocco Rex, where I take some recipes and I change them around a little bit and I see if I rock them or if I wreck them. And today is still pumpkin week, and but we're gonna do pumpkin martinis and drinks. And Christina's here to help me try them out. And we do have some food. So you can see this. Um, Pillsbury and Cinnabon have pumpkin grand rolls and they're right here and we may try them they look delicious i also cooked the pumpkin pop tarts right there and then i put some more of the pumpkin biscotti down too because we might get hungry while we're tasting all these drinks <laughs> so that is all right there and i just talked to christina and i said we should start with a shot right like why not start with a shot so we are going to start with some of this Fulton's Harvest Pumpkin Liqueur. So we're gonna do a shot of that. I, I showed this last week in coffee and it's really good in coffee. And then we're gonna use some Captain Morgan's Jacko Blast Pumpkin Rum. I'm already worried. <laughs> <laughs> already worried. Really strong. I know. I'm Let's already worried. The, the cutest shaker right there. Right. <laughs> and then why not put in a little bit fireball, right? <laughs> Jay, if you're watching, I know it's your favorite. And I'm gonna put about half a shot of this in there. That's good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then the I've had the booze all in the fridge, so it's already chilled. Do you want more ice in it? Do you want some ice in it? Or? No. That's all right, really all right. Let's just shake it up. <laughs> Give it a try. So we've got these cute little skeleton shot glasses. It looks good. It does look good. See, Luke is missing out. He really is. All right. Go Browns. Woo. That's really good. That's really good. <laughs> I, think, I think it's this. this is it is I mostly think. this. I'm like, I talked a lot about this last week. Oh. This stuff is amazing. That was really good. It's a little, it was a little sweet, but I think they're all going to be sweet. But yeah, that was, mm -hmm. that was good. I could, yeah. Yeah, you could do it. I could do it. I shouldn't, but I could. Maybe we'll do another one later. <laughs> All right, moving right along. Uh, like we're gonna do pumpkin liqueur and whipped vodka. So I'm gonna do that in this little shaker here. And I am gonna put some ice in it. All right. All right, so here we go. So pumpkin liqueur, let's do one of these now. And maybe that'll cut Cut it a little bit with the whipped cream vodka. All right, and then the whipped cream vodka. Are you jealous yet? Do you wish you were here? <laughs> Is that the week? You might, yeah, you might watch <laughs> us as we slowly, slowly deteriorate, and then you might say, no, I don't wish I was there at all. All right, here we go. This one we're gonna put in glasses. Oh. I'm not a bartender, nor do I ever <laughs> pretend to be one. Not even on live camera. Now we're not doing full drinks. <laughs> it is Sunday fun day, but we're not doing full drinks. We're just tasting. I'm gonna have to run and rinse things out as well. All right. All right, so this was pumpkin liqueur and whipped vodka. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, that's delicious. That's really good too. <laughs> I don't, this just like makes everything. I know, it's, that's delicious. I feel like you can't go wrong with that. Mmm. I could, I could drink a lot of those. Yeah. I, I think, I'm glad I used only one to two. Yeah. Yeah. But I could see this at like cashmere cricket or something. Yeah, that was very good. 
could put a little bit. I could take some of my pumpkin spice maybe and sprinkle a little bit on there. Oh, look, see, she's going to keep hers over by her. <laughs> All right, moving right along. We are doing, oh, goodness. <laughs> All right, we're going to do, we're, I'm going to rinse this out real quick. We're gonna do pumpkin liqueur. Or I'm, yeah, we're gonna do pumpkin again. And we're gonna do salted caramel vodka. So again, I think it's I think it makes more sense to do the two to one. Because this is this is really thick and creamy. So I think adding two of the other stuff cuts it down a little bit. I think this has such a strong flavor too. Yeah. <clears throat> Some ice in there again. Alrighty, that's. We'll see which one's better, the whipped vodka or the caramel. Vodka. I know, I know. I'm a little. I'm like, these are gonna be heaven for me. <laughs> now, if I haven't told you, um, this stuff is seasonal. So if you haven't tried this and you do try it and you love it, you need to stock up on it because it disappears before Christmas, maybe like even right after um, Thanksgiving. It doesn't last long. All right, here we go. All right. Are your hands sticky? Not yet. <laughs> I'm actually doing pretty good. Yeah. I was worried about that because I, there's my first faux pas. I was just gonna say I love it when the the bartender makes too much and then they give you that little oh yeah that little bit on the side on the side. I'm like yeah because that's what these little amounts remind me of is the perfect. You're, like, you're not gonna have that one. You're gonna have this nice one. Oh my gosh. Because <laughs> you're the special guest. <clears throat> All right, so. Salted caramel and the pumpkin liqueur. Wow. Mm. I kind of like the saltiness of it. It kind of breaks down the sweetness. The caramel is definitely strong in that one. Mm -hmm. I think I like the whipped one better though. I know, but they're both good. Mm -hmm. Oh gosh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, the next one is, let's see, uh, I should cross these out. The next one is pumpkin liqueur, oh, and the coffee and whipped cream vodka. Wow. I you know, I'm excited about this one. <laughs> so the coffee is pumpkin spice coffee from Starbucks. <laughs> you know, right? Naturally. Right? So, you know what, let's, let's just do half of, half of this. Let's just see what happens. So let's just take, a half a shot of this, and then let's do let's do a full shot of the coffee. And then the whipped cream vodka. Let's do a full shot of that. One. <laughs> course some ice now we have to have this in our other little cups it won't run to the sink and Drink up, witches. <laughs> <laughs> I should really shake these longer too, I think, because when I went to Kentucky, they said that the ice that they put in cocktails is really necessary 
like people say, give me less ice or whatever, they're like, actually the ice is really important mm -hmm. to the drink. I think that's my I, favorite actually. I really like that. I really like the coffee in there. And I think using less of that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that is really good. Mm. Come on over, I'll make you some. <laughs> <laughs> that's really good. Yeah. That's really good. All right. All right, now we're doing, we're doing time to rinse out. That's what we're doing. <laughs> so let me rinse something out. Feel free to add commentary, Christina, or try try something over there. All right, so the next one I'm doing is pumpkin liqueur and real pumpkin, fireball and some pumpkin spice. So I am going to do a full shot of this. I'm interested about this one with the real pumpkin in mm -hmm. it. Yeah. Oh, these pumpkins are good. Are they good? Mm-hmm. I have gone to places where they actually put real pumpkin puree okay. in the drink. So I thought, well, why not try it? So I'm just gonna put in like a tablespoon. Like like about that much. It's like a little meal. <laughs> I don't know about meal, but <laughs> I'm gonna use my finger. I did just wash my hands. All right. Um, just a little, I'm just using a half or a quarter of a teaspoon of pumpkin spice. I love those spice peppers. All right, oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. And then what did I say? Oh, fireball. No. <laughs> All right. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna use the rest of the fireball, <laughs> or at least a shot. Oh, that's the rest of it. Right, that's the rest. Guess what? That's the rest of it. Like, what do people use before Fireball? So I feel like that's. The you know, there is a cinnamon um, liquor. Um, I can't think off the top of my head what it's called, but there is. There is a cinnamon one, I think. If not, then I. Fireball took off. It did take off, and now you hear less about it, which mm -hmm. I'm okay with. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm okay doing a shot of Fireball, but it's not my favorite. Yeah. two more shot glasses for this one so I don't know where I found these but I don't like so them cute. I don't know they're perfect for Halloween I should have brought um, crown apple Jennifer what did Jennifer post the other day the apple something mm. I don't think I saw it oh this looks good this is a healthy shot <laughs> If shots could be healthy, this one's kind of healthy. Okay, my hand is cold. <laughs> <laughs> all right. I'm gonna drink to warm it up. Oh, it smells good. All right, all right. I'm taking this all we, we, Yeah, let's do it. Oh, all right, boy. here we go. All right. Go. Hmm. <laughs> that was interesting. It's, it was not bad. What do you think? Um, I actually like it. The aftertaste is really good. Yeah. I think when the spices, mm -hmm. from the spices come down. Yeah. Yeah. That's pretty good. All right. Um, oh, we have just one more to go. All right. So, well, we have a surprise one at the end. All right. So this one is going to be time to clean up because I want to make this. <laughs> All right, 
So this one is apple cider, salted caramel, and pumpkin liqueur. So let's use some of your apple cider that you brought by. Let's do... Mm -hmm. Should say thanks, Lauren. Thanks, Lauren. <laughs> Let's do a whole shot of this. Put that back here. And what I say, salted caramel. Do a whole shot of this. And then I do think I'll just do like the half again. Yeah. Of the <clears> pumpkin. <throat> Salted caramel vodka and apple cider was really popular. Yeah. I remember making that. I never, th I don't like a lot of salt, mm -hmm. but once I tried that, um, it was okay. It's not yeah. super salty. All right, this is getting that weird little, <laughs> that oh, weird little, no, it's curdling. Can, it's curdling. Oh, so let's see what happens when we have this. I put, I probably put too much ice in it. Here, yeah, scoop those up for me. I'm gonna break up the curdle, so. Yeah. They have this brain shot. I don't know if you've seen it too. You put stuff in it that kind of hangs in there um, oh. and it curls, it's kind of weird. I don't know if I'd like that. No. It's like on St. Patrick's Day, you have the Irish car ball and you have to drink it really fast. <laughs> yeah, because yeah, it gets gross. <laughs> All right, so this is apple cider, salted caramel, and pumpkin liqueur. Oh, it smells good. It does smell good. Okay. Ugh. Oh. oh. That's weird. There's something in there. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Mm. Let me try it again. Okay. <laughs> It kind of tastes like a caramel apple. It does kind of taste like a caramel there's apple, something but... something weird about it. It's so thick or something. It is... I don't know. I don't know. It just like coats your mouth. Yeah. In a bag. That one might be wrecked. Yeah. I'm like, I could drink the rest of it. Like, <laughs> I was a shot. I don't The sure. apple cider, maybe I wasn't expecting such a strong apple taste. Yeah. The apple cider... No. Yeah. It just makes it super, super yeah. sweet. Yeah. All right, that one is. Yeah. That's a tummy. That ache. one. That sounds like a tummy ache. All right, so our last one is if you have never used apple cider as a for a mimosa base. So taking my um, my my champagne flutes, and I I just wet the ridge the the ridge. Shots. I know, right? <laughs> so, see how, how nice that turns out? So that's cinnamon sugar. So I just have it in a little plate over here. So then, Christina was nice enough to bring some apple cider. I'm just gonna put my fork. <coughs> And then, do you want me to use this leftover that you brought? <laughs> you can. All right. So, she she practiced last night. <laughs> so we don't want to be wasteful. <clears throat> Things are tough around the world. We don't want to be wasteful. Exactly. So if you've never done, if you're ever gonna host like um, like a holiday brunch or something right now around Thanksgiving, Christmas. Halloween. Apple cider mimosas are awesome. So Cheers. hopefully it, a browns win today, right? Yes. Oh, that's mm. delicious. Yeah. Yeah. All right, well, there you go, guys. I, I showed you six different, seven if you count this one, seven <laughs> different drinks. Um, the six were made with the pumpkin liqueur. Uh, it was nice to have the pumpkin rum too. Um, try some of them out. Let me know what you think. 
Um, like and share as always, and we'll see you next week. Bye.